Hey guys, this episode we're gonna be talking about how to build some advanced action text sanitization um, in your Rails app. So this is an advanced feature that you'll probably need to use if you're gonna do anything complicated with action text. And we're gonna look at a quick example here. Let's say that we want to embed tweets inside of our action text content. So what I've got here is an example where I've already embedded this. We've done screencasts on adding um, embeds for Twitter and Instagram and uh, YouTube and other things like that in the past. The way that it works um, is that you use like an O-embed API, and this is an API that services will give you, and you can give it a URL to some page on their website, and they will return some JSON uh, with HTML on how you should embed that in your website. So you can dynamically do this very easily by asking, hey, what HTML should we use to render this the way that you would like? So if we were to use Twitter, they want us to have an anchor tag and they want us to have this script tag. Now, obviously, script tags are not allowed by default, so nothing actually happens. We just see this uh, anchor tag on the page when we render this out with action text. I've already taken that HTML and embedded that inside my document. If you want to test this out, you can open up a database viewer like um, uh, Table Plus here and just paste in the HTML right here in the document.